afternoon or good morning, whatever it may be for y'all. I think I might as well uh, keep uh, keeping the David Lindley uh, roll there.
Monday coming back to the show. Oh, Monday coming back to the show. Oh, Monday coming back to the show. Saw the everlasting festival. <laughs> All right. Yes, sir. Having an easy morning, most to think about an easy day. Maybe do a little fishing. Maybe sit, just sit back and play a couple songs for the birds. You know exactly what they gotta say. Seven these songbirds, thinking of lies. Singing a three-quarter time About that easy living Smells like that jerk chicken Don't feel nice Cricket singing all night I sit and listen to my paradise I sit and listen to my paradise Haven't done this song about ten years. Sometimes the words just leave you and you land right here. Yeah, feel that breeze blowing right off that ocean shore. And you are certain no you know you landed in paradise once more. Think about easy living. The breeze that smell like chicken.
when you got through. I wish you could see how the highways are run by doors. Internet highways, subways, skyways, but nobody's kitchen no more. When you were right, hard times of gambling with miners and migrants of old. You walked the line, you spoke your mind, telling stories that had to be told. Hey, when you go free, where are you? We could show you she wants more. The big dogs are back at the door. The pastures are plenty, are not seen by many. There's no faces there at the door. The fields are all empty, in the pastures of money. His farms aren't for people no more. The yeah, we let machines steal away dreams, and genetics are the new golden doors. But it props that we breed, body for feet. A corporation or the poor. Hey, Woody Guthrie, where are you? We could show you she wants more. Hey, Woody Guthrie, where are you? The big dogs are back at the door. Sensation of feeling like they're part of it all. With no sense of the land, and the advertising man got brand new logos for them all. There can be no denying that their farm feels dying out there on suburbia's door. Since it's taken our soul, and we've been losing control. What if we need you once more? Hey, what it got me? Where are you?
Who's that dark man for you? Well, I'm a big fan of bluegrass music, folks, and uh, the first cat, I, first guy I heard play bluegrass music that really freaked me out was all my buddies. Quadraphonic stereo system in 1976. The Doc Watson old post office album. Comes on. Chuck Taylor, Norman Blake, and all that good stuff. And it's been down the bluegrass highway ever since for me. And the, that was the day before we went to see the David Bromberg big band. To a kid from Pittsburgh in ninth grade, and it kind of kind of had it for me. <laughs> Here's a Doc Watson tune for you. Kind of uh, convoluted by a guy up in the uh, state of Washington named Larry Hanks, who uh, got to sing this song for the governor of Idaho once upon a time. <laughs> Sun Valley was such a bore. Well, I got my headbands and my Gucci duds. Went up to work in the Idaho Spuds. Well, I wandered on down into Berlin Town. I found a cute little russet, knobby and brown. I said, sweet thing, I'll dig you later. Now I'm looking for the Idaho Tater. Well, the Idaho Spud was long and green. Covered with butter and sour cream. Where it's pulled from the ground and washed off the mud. Oh, there never was a teacher like the Idaho Spud. <laughs> well, they eat the lobster on the coast of Maine and the Gila monster on the Texas plain. Well, I never would have made it across the Nebraska floods if it hadn't been riding off the Tennessee Spud. Well, you can make it into vodka, you can make it into beer, you can eat it with a pizza or an old dead steer. Well, it got me the word from Uncle Fudd, never was a tater like the Idaho Spud. Well, the Idaho Spud was long and lean, covered with butter and sour cream. Just pulled it from the ground and washed off the mud, oh, there never was a tater like the Idaho Spud. This is the verse he got to sing for the governor of Idaho, and they're thinking about putting that nuclear waste isolation plant in up there. Now there's nuclear waste on the desert floor, and the NRC wants to bring in more. There's a hole in the ground where they put in the crud, radioactive Idaho spud. Now there's a cute little mutant on a cabin floor, and another half kid that's stopping the door. They lighten right up like green tomatoes, feeding them radioactive taters. Well, the Idaho spud was long and green, covered with butter and glory and green. The jazz pulled from the ground and was up the crud, oh, there never was a tater. Never was a tater, never was a tater like the Idaho spud. Well, I'm a redneck hippie, it don't make sense. I'm a redneck hippie, I'm for both sides of the fence. I'm a good old boy, and I'm a flower child, I love to get stoned, I like to get wild. I'm a redneck hippie, what am I gonna do? I used to be stoned up, all around a kid with hair hanging out of my back. We just smoke my cools and I pop my pills and burn that incense down. Still like a buzz every now and then, but I turn my head around. And I got me a job just working real hard for the government. I'm a redneck hippie, and it don't make sense. I'm a redneck hippie, I'm from both sides of the fence. I'm a good old boy, and I'm a dope smoker fiend. I love to get stoned, I like to get mean. I'm a redneck. What am I gonna do? Well, my hair's not as long as it used to be, but it still hangs down to my back. And when I see my boss in a slot top, I thank God that I'm not like that. I like that kick-ass country band. It used to be rockin' and rollin'. 
But when it's party time, I let it all hang out at my hippie side takes control. I'm a redneck hippie, it don't make sense. I'm a redneck hippie, I'm from both sides of the fence. Yeah, I'm a good old boy and I'm a flower child. I love to get stoned, I like to get wild. I'm a redneck hippie, what am I gonna do? Around the sun. I love the woman like an easy rider, don't you? Don't believe I love it. Look at the food that I've been. Don't believe it. I'm singing. Look at this hole that I'm in now. Stealing, stealing. Pretty mama, don't you tell on me? Cause I'm stealing back to that same old. Walk across town just to feed her cat. You don't believe it, I love her. Look at the food and I'm in. You don't believe me, I'm missing her. Look at the food and I'm in now. Stealing, stealing. Pretty mama, don't you tell on me. Cause I'm a stealing back to that same old used to be. I see the loving in my baby's eyes. 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 I see
When I think of you, my son, I, I see myself when I was young and the hardest thing I'd ever done was to leave you in the ground. Sunset, so it always warms up a little bit at, at night out there. So, you know, I just wanted to inform my guitar what he's doing. You know. Sorry, you know, it, it may be you know five degrees and fifty mile an hour winds, and snow, like last year. I've called the airline to see if it's possible to cancel all flights the next week. I don't, I don't know if it's going to work. <laughs> comes from within. It comes from within. You know, I better tell you this story before I do this all. Because, you know, it kind of makes it better. You know, there's this, uh, there's a cemetery in Macon, Georgia. With Dwayne Almond's buried. Greg Almond's buried there now. And Elizabeth Reed is buried there. Of course, from the famous Allman Brothers song, In Memory of Elizabeth Reed. So my buddy was hanging on Elizabeth Reed's tombstone on a beautiful Macon, Georgia night, eating LSD in the moonlight, sitting on Elizabeth Reed's grave, and noticed that next to Elizabeth Reed was her daughter, Maud. And they had like this concrete one piece tombstone, you know, between the two. And right out of the middle was this flower popping up. It comes from within. It comes from without. With a little time, we'll figure it out. Maud only knows how a flower grows between the stones. Standing all alone. Standing all alone. Don't weep for me, I'm not gone, I'll be right here, you're not alone, singing my song over my stone, don't you know that it feels just like we're home, it comes from within. Right here, 
secret with you. It's actually a, a parody of a song that I found on a Songs for Mormon Children record. <laughs> and, and you want to hear that? That want to hear that verse to see where that goes. Okay. When I grow up, I want to be a mother. No other job for me. Uh, and, and, uh, and I, I, I make cookies all day long. Eat them cookies and milk and yellow balloons. And cover them, cover them when things go wrong. Tell them stories and sing them pretty tunes. When I grow up, I want to be a mother. I raise a family, six little, seven little, eight little blessings from above. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, yeah. That. So, all these years later, like kids in Boulder are singing the alfalfa song in their school choir and all that stuff. And, but there, for a lot of years, there was no alfalfas, and then then Whole Foods bought them. And you can get alfalfas delivered to your door by drone in just probably a, a week or so. You know? So. Uh, in the meantime, before the alfalfa was resurfaced, I had to, you know, we were playing the same radio station and they asked me to do the song again and I, all right, well, here's what came out. Now when I grow up, don't want to work at alfalfa, cause it's not there anymore. It's been absorbed by a huge conglomerate corporate health food store. At which point the DJ about threw up because alfalfa's Whole Foods is one of their major sponsors. <laughs> Thank 
corporate health food store. Yeah. I'd have a job and not invented brand new produce, invent Terminator jeans. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. It got, got worse from there. Um, and uh, anyways, when I grow up, I want to work and help out us and do the cheese and dairy free, a Birkenstock, spandex, necktie, but truly grocery store. Where it turns out, if you go to just the right aisle at Ophelpha's, you can buy some pepper. <laughs> In a Vaseline, who put the pepper in a Vaseline? Oh no, I can't stand it, babe. Well, one night down at the Bronco Media, Bronco did bombs are hanging out. Tried to bail from the hooker, but the maid she found out. They were sneaking out, she was sneaking in. She put the pepper in a Vaseline and another bomb began. Yeah, who put the pepper in a Vaseline? In a Vaseline, who put the pepper in a Vaseline? Oh no, I can't stand it, babe. We're running up and tell you right, these key bombs hanging out. Try to live in the hotel, but the maid she found out. She was thinking it while they were making it out. She put the pepper in the Vaseline and said, I heard a sound. Now, who put the pepper in the Vaseline? Who put the pepper in the Vaseline? Who put the pepper in the Vaseline? Oh no, I can't stand the pain. Well, months go by and they cannot pay no rent. Well, the landlord, he come in, he thought they were bailing out. You put the pepper in the Vaseline, he said, oh, yeah. Who put the pepper in the Vaseline? Who put the pepper in the Vaseline? Who put the pepper in the Vaseline? Oh, no, I can't stand the pain. Thank you, I sure love being here.
Yeah. 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 Yeah.